We begin tonight with breaking news. The Warren Town Council has voted to revoke the license of the club where the town's assistant fire chief was killed two weeks ago. I'm Mike Montecalvo. And I'm Shannon Heggy. Brian Remy was shot and killed at the Italian American Club on September 2nd. Another person was injured. The alleged shooter took his own life after the shootout with police. 12 News reporter Rob Nesbitt was at, was at tonight's meeting, which got emotional at times. He joins us now live from Warren with the details. Rob? Mike, several people spoke tonight from members of the Italo American Club to Ryan Remy's son, sharing their thoughts on what they think should happen to the club's liquor license, where police say the man at fault had his first drink by 7 a.m. Warren's town council meeting started with a moment of silence for Brian Remy. Before moving on to the business at hand, Detective Christopher Peralt says his investigation of the shooting showed that the suspect, Michael Ouellette, started drinking at the Italo American Club during the morning hours. Between the hours of 7 and 10, uh, it was reported that he had uh, at least two beers. Detective Peralt says that Ouellette was also drinking prior to shooting and killing Warren Assistant Fire Chief Brian Remy. Remy's son, Robert Remy, says the building where his dad was murdered has a reputation in town. It wasn't a place I never thought my father would hang out in, but it has changed and people change. Remy spoke in support of having the club's liquor license revoked. The wrong thing happened that day, and I hope the right thing happens tonight. Joseph Benavides has been a member of the club for 25 years. He doesn't believe the club is to blame for Remy's murder, but says this happened because of Ouellette's mental health. He was having issues and needed help. We should have helped him, but it was too late. After more than an hour of hearing from officers, lawyers, and the public, the five members of the Warren Town Council voted unanimously to revoke the club's liquor license. Aye. 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 Attorney for the club, Kevin Bristow, says the council got it wrong and let their emotions decide their vote. All of them eulogizing Brian Remy. Um, I don't know what could be more, a greater evidence of, of the, the difficulty that rendering an objective, fair decision. Bristow says that he plans on filing an appeal in the morning with the Rhode Island Department of Business Regulation. Reporting live in Warren, I'm Rob Nesbitt, 12 News.